we are in the third grade my math book we're going to work on pages 193 and 194 today hands-on model multiplication lesson one essential question what does multiplication mean when you have equal groups you have the same number of objects in each group use repeated addition to find the total number of objects find the total in four equal groups of five Use connecting cubes to show four equal groups of five cubes and draw the groups. So four equal groups of five cubes. You have one, two, three, four, five, and I have four groups. So I'm gonna draw these four groups and I'm going to draw five cubes. Five, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So there's my drawing, there are four groups with five in each. Write the number of cubes in each group and use repeated addition to complete the number sentence. So I would say five plus five plus five plus five equals 20. So the total in four groups of five is 20. Record the number of groups, the number of each group and the total from above. Explore other ways to group the 20 cubes equally. Number of groups is four, number in each group is five, and the total is 20. You could also, if you move those cubes around, you could have five groups with four in each, and the total would still be 20. You could have 10 groups with two in each, and the total would be 20. Or you could do um, one group with 20 in each group, and the total would be 20. You just have one group. Let's go to page 194 here. You can also use multiplication to find the total number of objects in equal groups. A number sentence with the symbol X is called multiplication sentence. It means multiply. So this symbol X means times or groups of. Okay. Show it or try it. Sean helped his mom bake cookies. He served four cookies on each plate. There are two plates. How many cookies did he serve? Find the total of two plates of four cookies. Use the counters to model the equal groups and draw the groups. So I have two plates and I have four cookies. One, two, three, four on that. And it says four cookies on each plate. So he also has four cookies on this plate too. Draw a number sentence of repeated addition. So it's four plus four equals eight. Write a multiplication sentence to show two plates of cookies or two groups of four. So two groups of four equals eight. So Sean served eight cookies. So there's two different ways we could solve this. We can do a repeated addition or multiplication, which we're going to learn multiplication is a bit quicker. Talk about it. How can addition help you find the total number of objects in each group? So addition gives you the total with an addition sign here. So we are adding to find the total. Number two. How did you find the total number of cubes in step two of the first activity? So the first activity here, what did we do? We wrote a ad repeated addition. So we wrote a repeated addition sentence to solve. Sean counted a batch of cookies by finding four plus four plus four. How could he, multiplication help him find the total? So if you see, we have four plus four plus four. So maybe Sean made some more cookies. So now he has one, two, three groups of four. And three groups of four can be written like that, which will give us 12. So the total is 12 cookies.